Hello everybody, this is Dee King Bay, your book granny here with an unboxing. Oh yeah, today we have Fairy Lou. If my calculations are correct, this should be my September uh, 2024 box. Um, the YA one is a monthly subscription. You get the box, ooh, it doesn't open. You get box and goodies in the box. Oh, let me open it up. Goodness, turn around, I need to work out more, right? So. Let's go through this. I will say I used to have three boxes. Here, this one is Mastermind. That's pretty artwork. You know, I like it when someone's doing something devious. But anyway, here's the art card for it. That's nice. Um, put the spoilers down. So I used to also have Owl Crates and Aluma Crates boxes. So I get rid of, got rid of Owl Crates because it was just too many duplicate boxes. I mean, books. When I had Owl Crates and their boxes, I mean, their books weren't the best anyway of looking, that is. So if I'm gonna already get the book from somebody else, I might as well get it from somebody else and not pay for theirs too. And the boxes, if you have all three boxes, you end up getting a lot of the same things. Granted, they are different um, themed for different books, but still the same item. Ooh, this is cute. Babel Tower, a tea light holder. Look at that. That is nice. I know someone who's gonna wanna steal this from me, y'all. I'm not gonna name no names, but I call her my best friend because she actually is my best friend. But, ooh, Babel Tower. Let me see what this looks like. That is not, ooh. Just looking at the box. Look at that. This is nice. Yeah. Let me open this bad puppy up. See what we got going on. So far, this box is nice, isn't it? So I am only going to keep the Fairy Loot box because, like I said, the places, they um pretty much give you the same items over and over oh that's just a piece of wood to i don't know what it's for but anyway oh this is nice ceramic can you hear that ceramic there we go look at that you put your little tea light in there babel who's an rf kwang yeah this is nice oh it says something inside y'all let me see we're here to make magic with words oh all right oh it's got rf kwang in there too so you'll know who it's from bye yeah that's nice that's gonna be cute of course, I don't put fire by my books, right? <laughs> so, but I, I got places. I'm always burning uh, candles, so this is nice. Yeah, this will put a real nice little light at night. Ooh, maybe tonight I'll put a little candle in and take a little picture so y'all can see. That is nice. Right, nice. Right, right, nice. So far, so good. Way to go, Fairy Loop. So let me put this down, get our next item. Our next item is... This is one of those things that you put your bowl in when you put it in the microwave so it doesn't get too high. Is it big enough? I guess you could put a real small bowl on it. I have a few of these. I like them. I actually got one from, it was before I canceled my subscription, so it must have been an Illumicrate, right? I mean, it's canceled the box part, so it must have been an Illumicrate. So here we go. I will find out who this is uh, inspired by. Upside down. There we go. So there we go. And I do like these little cozies. Is that what they're called? Cozies? That's what I'm calling it. It's probably called something else official. Y'all know I be making up names, right? Hey, they work for me. Looky here. You know, I love... This is those mats. I can see that already. See, that's a mat that you put in front of your computer. A desk mat, I guess they call them. So, I got to tell y'all. My husband went and bought a desk mat. I think because he saw my lovely desk mat. Then he wanted one too, talking about his better than mine. Whatever. Yeah, granted, his is cute. But uh, mine is better because it's mine. <laughs> there you go. Oh, I can't get this open. Let's see. It says Throne of Glass. Oh, this one's Throne of Glass. I have, I ordered the set of Throne of Glass from um, Acrylic Picks. Yeah. Haven't read them yet. It's a lot. I mean, someone asked me to start a, a series the other day. I'm like, oh, that's a big commitment. <laughs> You know, I just can't do series right now. That's upside down. But anyway, let me show you guys. Whoa, it's big. It's a mat after all. Here we go. That is nice. I'm looking over top. Oh, I like this. That's pretty. That's nice. They did a good job on this. That is nice. And by the way, I did get one of these. Not this one. From Illumicate right before I canceled my subscription for the box part. I think it was my last thing was a mat. And I said, I bet I get a mat from somebody else. That's why I canceled my other subscriptions. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love the mats and all that sort of stuff, but I don't need three sets of everything. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I got rid of two of them. Let's see what we got going on here. Something in a pouch. 
Let's see, Fairy Loot, A Tempest of Tea. That was a good book. I have like copies of that. Yep, I got three copies right there. <laughs> but A Tempest of Tea, uh, let me see. Ethereum Maker, oh, I know what this is. Okay, and A Tempest of Tea, you know that's a vampire. You know I ain't in the vampire, so it's very light vampire elements on it. But look, this came from there directly from the thing, so I know what this is. Yeah, I'm not gonna tell you because I don't wanna give you no spoilers, but this is an item from the book. This is so cute. Oh, I like this so much. That's a good one. This is really nice. Those of you who have read that book, you're like, ah! Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. Good. They're doing good, I gotta say. I'm glad I kept this box. <laughs> the tarot cards are usually from the book itself, so I should probably do the book and then the tarot cards, but whatever. Let's see, Knight of Sons and Page of Sons. Here we go. It's usually characters from whatever the book is, it seems like. But I don't know what the book is, and I don't know who these folks are. So, hey, there you go. There we go. But they are always lovely. Okay. I got to tell y'all the truth. I pretty much use them tarot cards as, like, bookmarks a lot of times. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. I know I should keep them with the book, right? But whatever. I'd be like that sometime. Oh, inside is the Fairy Loot Scoop, which I don't you know, show you guys, but yep, the little scoop, what's going on, all that good stuff. Okay, let's see, The Dagger and the Flame by Catherine Doyle. So I actually watch uh, reaction videos or whatever these are, unboxings or whatever, and I learned, see, watching stuff that a lot of times fairy do what they do is they take the actual cover, just flip the colors for you, for their cover and then on their alternate cover or their alternate artwork that's where they do their thing so there you go there you have it see i learned something new i love watching the reactions see if people think the same thing i did when i watch it but i always watch the reactions after i've done mine because i don't want to spoil it for myself so there we go let me look at this now y'all got a chance to look at it let me see it Ooh, i like that sword dagger whatever that thing is it looks like a sword more than a dagger though and this book is called Dagger and the Flame. But okay, look, don't that look like a sword instead of a dagger? I'm just saying right there. But anyway, whatever. I guess it is a dagger. They say it's a dagger. Okay, this is pretty. I like this cover better though. I actually like this better. And this is probably the original cover I'll look for when I uh, edit it, then I'll know. Okay, let's set that down. That's lovely, lovely. Both sides are nice. Ooh, you know I like my gold foiling. Yeah, now that's definitely a dagger. There we go. That's nice foiling on there. Look at that. That's real nice. You know what I didn't do? I didn't show you guys this edging. It did that thing. I'm going to put that cover back on there so y'all can see that. That is nice. It goes well with the cover. Okay, here you go. Look at this. It's blocked on the top and bottom. But then turn it to the side and bam. That's nice, huh? It looks like that. That is nice. They did a good job on them. Let me get real close so you can see. Yep, not seeing lines in or anything. That is nice, real nice. They did a good job. Good job, good job. Okay, let's take this cover off here again so you guys get back to seeing what you're supposed to be seeing. I was doing stuff out of order, y'all. I gotta stop that mess. Slow down, dear tree, slow down. There we go. That's nice falling on there. I can tell what it is. That's our little dagger. And on the back, of course, they got the flame. Ba -ba -ba bam There we go. I will say that with all this gold on here and black, this isn't as um, stunning, shall we say, because uh, you know what I'm saying, see? Yeah. I like it better with the this cover on it because it draws that red into it. But it's still nice. Nice, nice, nice. Just because it's not my favorite doesn't mean it's not nice. Okay. Ooh, yeah. Cut his neck. Y'all see that falling around there? And they followed my rule. If you're going to have them people on there, have them doing something, she's going to cut his throat. I can live with that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I can live with that. <laughs> he may not be able to live with that, but I can. Okay, here's the back end page. Okie dokie. See what we got in here. Probably be an author letter in here pretty soon. Where's the author letter? There it is, the author letter. And 
let's see if we have any kind of, oh, there's the map. And as always, you know Fairy Loot likes to throw something at the back. Let me see what it says. Exclusive Fairy Loot chapter. Ugh. Okay, I hate to sound like a Debbie Downer, but you know I don't like it when they put an extra chapter in a book. Because, you know, like I say, even if I didn't get the exclusive edition, you know, which is how it looks, the content of the book itself, the story should be the same. So if they put an extra chapter in there, it's fluff. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It better not have something to do with the content of the story. So I, that's just me personally. I don't like that mess. So anyway, that's that. So here it is. This is a beautiful book. My favorite item was the Babel Tower. That is so a cool. I already know I'm not going to get to keep this. I, already, I, I can feel people saying, oh, I want that. This is adorable. So actually the whole box is good. My second favorite, oh, wait a minute. I can't say the Babel Tower is my favorite. I lied to myself because my favorite is actually this pen from a Tempest of Tea because I understand it completely and I'm going to put it with all my other pens. Actually, I might keep this pen separate because this one actually, I love this one. This one's great. And I highly suggest you read that book. It was really good. It's part of a duology. It's the first book in a duology. So you might want to wait a little while until the second book comes out because I hate having to wait. <laughs> for the second book so yeah so that is it you guys have a great day bye bye